Hey everybody, Steven here, and for today's video, I'm going to talk about how you do the background removal if you have the Logitech C922. Now, I purchased this last week, and one of the first questions was, how do you do that? Um, didn't find any options in the Logitech software. Turns out you actually have to download something else. What you have to download is ChromaCam. So with this, that's the thing that's actually going to remove the background. I'll put a link for this in the description box, chromacam.me. Now, once you have downloaded that, when you're in whichever software, and I'm using XSplit right now, but if I'm using OBS, it's the same thing, you're going to choose the Chroma Cam. You're not going to choose the Logitech C922 camera. You're going to choose this. It'll pop up, and then that's what auto-removes. As you can see, it works pretty well, depending upon the background, but if you notice, it's not 100%. Um, and obviously, I'm wearing the headset here, so certain areas, it's not going to do that. But I mean... If I don't want to mess with the green screen, it works decent. I have one coming, so that should make this actually a little bit better. And a mic, so I won't have the headset here. But you're going to choose that in the software. That'll pop up. And you have to have Chroma Cam pulled up. You can't just try and activate it via XSplit or OBS. So I actually have to pull up Chroma Cam, then go into... Um, whichever software and then select chroma cam from there and then it'll do that you can add little effects to the background right which obviously i'm not going to mess with any of that um and this is a streamer option versus the classic right which i don't think i'd use any of this either um a green screen which i don't know how to edit that just yet but one of the things with this is like looking at how do you do the logo how do you do slides all this other stuff and that's going to be more for the person that wants to pay for the software. And I'm not going to mess with that, which is why I pulled this up. If you're looking at Chroma Cam Lite, which is free, use it forever. Virtual green screen, background blur, standard image backgrounds, right? Chroma Cam Pro, no watermarks, custom backgrounds and logos, support for PowerPoint slides. That seems like it's going to be more for the person that's doing PowerPoint presentations and they're running some type of YouTube business um, where they're wanting that. Or maybe you're a Twitch streamer or... Um, a gamer that wants your logo on the background, whatever it may be, your team logo on the background, that's not going to be for your average day user, which I consider myself to be. So hopefully that helps anybody that was curious as to how you do that. And um, like I said, I'll put that in the description box for you guys. And like it said before, it, it works with XSplit or OBS. I'm still tinkering with OBS, a little bit harder to learn. Um, XSplit, once I got it going, was a little bit easier to work with. So I'm sticking with that for right now. But if you guys like the video, hit the like button for me. If you want to continue to follow along with all of my content, hit the subscribe button for me. Thanks so much for watching.